Hi guys, welcome back to World Mechanics. In today's video we're going to show you how to remove and replace that seat belt on a Mercedes W163. So this one will be from 98 all the way until 2005 model. And as you can see this one was in a minor crash and the seat belt is done. It's not moving at all so we need to replace it. So before you proceed you need to make sure you unhook your battery for at least 30 minutes before you do the job because that's part of the airbag system. So what you need to do now, you have that plastic cover for the seat and you have two screws with Phillips screwdriver, one here, one there to remove it. Pretty simple, you just take it out of the way. And now, next thing that we need to do, we need a flathead screw, screwdriver. Okay, you need to go like that underneath it, make sure that you get the plastic piece, okay, like that, and you pull it out. You start from the front and then you pull it out of there because that's the one that goes in the groove. And now there is four, four screws that we need to remove right here with the Phillips screwdriver. Okay, one right here, two, three and four. So all these four you need to remove them now. Okay, now on the back, in the back door right there, the doorstep, there is one more clip that you need to remove the same way. You just slide it to the back this time when you pull all the clips out because you can see that's the one that's facing forward like that. And now there is two screws that we need to remove with a few of screwdriver down there, one there and one right there. Remove those two now. Now on the bottom right there you have two caps that you need to remove with a flat head screwdriver. Those have two clips. They come out of there, okay, like that. And just remove both of them. And under them there is two more screws with a, with a few of screwdriver. Remove them as well. So what you need to do next, you need to grab right here on the front and just pull it up. You need to do the same procedure on the back as well. And for the back, it, you need to slide it forward to come out of there. Okay, and the whole trim piece is right here in one piece. So that plastic cover now, it's held by a few clips, so you can just grab your hand inside of it and pull. Okay, you're gonna hear them and now on top you have two more clips right here. I'll show them to you once I remove the once we remove the thing. And you eventually get it out of there. And now that's a plastic piece we removed and now underneath it right there, there is two screws. One right there and one right here. How to show you guys exactly where it's located. But you need to remove these two with a few of screwdriver as well. Okay, now that plastic trim, you pull it out. And on the top right here, there is a few more clips that you can pry with the help of the screwdriver again. Okay, right there, that's where the clip is, so you can remove it. Okay, now on the seat, this ball right here, it's with Torx, with the T50, so we need to remove this one. Those are usually, usually very tight, so just you might have to use a break over bar and they come loose all at once so careful not to hurt yourself when it breaks loose and just take it off all the way they usually have thread lock to prevent it from unscrewing which could prevent in loose seat belt okay we took it off and now there is one more with that T50 that we need to do right here that holds the the uh, seat belt assembly right here so we need to remove that bolt as well it's almost all the way down to the close to the floor so take this one off as well okay it's almost all the way loose now and what you, what you need to do next right here on top there is one more nut that you need to remove in order to be able to pull the seat belt out of the car it's with a 17 millimeter socket right here just take it off all the way and the seat belt will come out of it. Okay, those are usually tight. Seat belt parts are usually very tight. Okay, it came out of there. And now we need to pull it through that plastic piece. It comes out in a certain angle. Okay, you can see it. And we don't need that trim. And now what we need to do, we need to pull the belt up. Okay, you're going to see. It comes up like that. See the wire is right here in the way. 
and it comes out and now in order to remove the the airbag thing what you need to do you need to pull out okay guys this is the uh, the seat belt assembly right here so that's how you remove it thank you guys for watching us don't forget to subscribe and give us a like we upload about a new video every day